Hi lovelies, all right, so here we have a problem to solve. It says that 4 is raised to the power of y and is equal to 100 and we are to find the value of y, all right? Okay, so um, solution. Okay, so first of all, you notice that uh, whenever a number is raised to a variable, it's expected that that variable should be brought down. So we are going to bring down by taking the logarithm of both sides. So we will have uh, log 4 to the power of y to be equal to the log of 100. Okay. So and um, why did we do that? Because there is a rule that says that if I have the log of um, that it is the same thing as x log a. Okay so that means the x can come to the back as a product all right so if we apply that here we are going to have y log 4 to be equal to now we will divide both sides by log 4 so we will have this will go away and then our y is equal to log 100 but you know that 100 is the same as 10 to the power of 2 all over and log 4 is also 2 to the power of 2 and then i can actually do the same thing i did here by bringing the 2 that i have as powers down and that will give me 2 log 10 all right so my 2 will cancel out Okay, so my y will now be equal to log 10 all over log 2. But of course, you know that there is a rule in log reading again that says that if I have log, let's say, x over log y, that means their bases are the same, base 10. Once the bases are the same, that you should just write it as log x base y. So that means we can write this as a log of 10 to the base of 2. Beautiful. Okay, so that will now lead us to now have that our y is equal to, I can break 10 down into 2 times 5. I hope you know that and all is in base 2. Now, the question is, why did I do that? Because we, by the rule of log redeem, this is the same thing as log 2 base 2 plus log 5 in base 2. Okay, so, and you are done. So, you can clearly see that from there, log of a number to the same base is 1 plus, then the other one you cannot simplify, so you can just leave it as log 5 base 2 as your solution now meanwhile you can quickly run a check to see that this is correct so let's use this other one now remember we said that 4 is to the power of y and is equal to 100 so all you need to do is to insert your power which is y as 1 plus log of 5 to base 2 and that is going to give you by rule of uh, indices addition changes to multiplication so this will be 4 to the power of 1 multiplied by log uh, uh, sorry 4 to the power of log 5 base 2 all right and 4 to the power of 1 is 4 and then by now here i can write 4 as 2 to the power of 2 and that too will multiply the existing power here, which is log 5, log 5 to the base of 2. Okay, now watch what will happen. So you can clearly now see that uh, this is going to give us 4 times. Now these two can also come up here, you know, the same way we did up where y came down. So it can come up. So you have 2 to the uh, power of log 5 raised to the power 2 which is 25 all in base 2 but then um there is a rule in log again that says that if i have a number if i have a number let's say a 
raised to the power of log x to the same base now the number is raised to the power of a log and the log has the base of the original number we have here so what we have there is that this log a base a will cancel this one below so you just have x so in other words this guy will cancel this and just give us 25 and of course you know that 4 times 25 is 100 and that has satisfied what we were given originally all right so and that is the solution to this if you like what i have done here subscribe to my youtube channel and um, give a thumbs up to this video and uh, you can also do this one all right so let me see in the comment section the solution to 9 to the power of x equal to 36 see you in other videos bye